the comp section is where you will be able to calculate the after repair value of a property using public records and MLS listings. You can also view neighboring records to gain local knowledge or view the cash buyers around the subject property. The three horizontal bars below the comps box will let you select view report or save comps. View report will generate a report reflecting the comps that have been selected. At the bottom of the report, you can select save, which stores the report into the docs section, but also locks in the filters and the comps you have selected. The last option is share. This will let you share notes, the comps report, and any other available documents with a fellow team member or an external contact. The Save Comps button will simply lock in the filters and the results that you have selected. This helps save you time by not having to reapply those filters when revisiting the property later. To the right of the horizontal bar, you will have the option to choose the data source for running comps. The options are public records, MLS records for those in non-disclosure states or want sold listings not yet recorded at the county, or for advanced users, feel free to use both. To the right is the filter icon. This feature lets you apply filters to isolate sold comps nearly identical to the subject property. Whether you need to increase or decrease the sell date range, the search distance, apply property characteristics, or perhaps change the MLS status to view not just sold listings, but active and pending as well. These filters are here to help. Just make sure to select apply down below. To the right of the filter icon is the gear icon. This feature will allow you to customize and save the layout of how the results are presented to you. More than one layout can be saved and any one of them can be made to be the default layout when viewing the comps of any property. Below, you will be able to select what headers you want change the size of the columns to bring more attention or less attention to certain headers. And by tapping and holding down a column header, you can rearrange the column position. Make sure to select apply or apply and save to lock in any changes you have made. In the center of comps, you will see the summary informing you of the number of comps selected, the average sell price of the comps selected, and the average price per square footage. And finally, below the summary, you will be able to view the comps results. This area will allow you to select all or deselect the comps that have been isolated after you applied your filter. Users may also tap on any of the comps to see a brief description of the property. From here, they may click on the image of the property to view additional photos, or select details to view the details of that comp. The alternative to tapping is holding down on the results, in which PropStream will take you straight to the comps details. We understand that the results may be a bit tight in terms of space and viewing details, so feel free to tap on the black bar at the top to collapse the map and space out your results a bit more. You may also turn your, your smart device horizontally to see more details. Thank you for watching.